Hi guys, uh, so it's Christmas already, you can see. Anyways, uh, the reason for the video today is I wanted to talk to you about repeating the test for COVID. Once you're positive for COVID, a lot of people call the clinic, call their primary doctors, send text messages, calls, and asking, when can I get retested? How do I know that I don't have the virus anymore? Well, the answer is we don't retest. We shouldn't retest. And the reason why we shouldn't retest for COVID is because you can still be positive for up to 45 days after initiation of symptoms. You will see a lot of people getting test after test. We usually turn them down because there is no reason to retest if you are asymptomatic or if you have been diagnosed for more than 10 days. The CDC, which is the Center for Disease Control, is already giving us the advice that we can clear somebody to return to work and break isolation if they are asymptomatic for at least 10 days after the symptoms start. We like to be a little bit more cautious and we sometimes tell people that they should be uh, on isolation for 10 days after the diagnosis has been made, but usually uh, it is after the symptoms start. The reason why we shouldn't retest is because uh, once it's positive, it can still be positive for 45 days, but the virus that we are detecting is dead. It's not able to really multiply, it's not really able to infect anybody else. Now, if after 10 days of symptoms, you still have, uh, I'll repeat that, if after 10 days of uh, initiation of symptoms, you still are experiencing certain symptoms such as, such as fever, body aches, or shortness of breath, then the advice is to uh, continue on isolation until you are completely asymptomatic for at least three days in a row. Cough is not one of those symptoms because people with COVID can actually cough for three, four weeks. The cough should always be becoming um, less frequent and less intense. If that is happening, then that cough is fine. That is just a residual cough from the inflammation caused by, by the infection. Um, but again, the active symptoms should be fever, body aches, and insurance of breath, all right? If there's any question, please post uh, your question down on the comment section. Thank you.